Oh hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In today's video we're going to take a look at how to install the NVIDIA drivers for vanilla Arch Linux. During the installation process you have the option to install these NVIDIA drivers and while this is good enough for day-to-day -day tasks, this is certainly not the case for gaming, let's say. If you intend to do any gaming on your PC, you need to install a couple more packages and you need to go through a couple more steps. So today that's what we are doing. The first thing that you might have to do is enabling the multi-lib. And while you have this option again during the installation process, if you have missed it for some reason, I'm going to show you how you can enable it right now. Unfortunately for this, you will have to use the terminal. And I promise you it's not that bad and it's not that scary. What you need to do is type sudo and yes, I am going to use none for this. And don't worry about this guys, I am going to leave everything I use in this video in the description down below. We need a root password for this of course. And this is the configuration file for Pacman, the package manager for Arch Linux. We are looking for the multi-lib part, which is somewhere down on the bottom. Yes, it's right here. And if you have lines starting with these two symbols, all you have to do is just remove them. So yours have to look something like mine here. When you remove the symbol in front of the lines, all you have to do is save the file with Ctrl O. Ctrl X for exit and that's, that's it. That's all you need to do. The next step is installing the base devel package and installing the Linux headers. Again, we're going to use the terminal for this. Type down sudo pacman s base develop and linux dash headers this is very important you might have already installed that but in some rare cases the headers are not installed with the with the system so you need to install them manually also you need to know what is the version of the Linux kernel you are using. In my case here, I'm using the stock version that comes with the Linux install. But if you are using, for example, Linux LTS, all you have to do is just write down Linux-LTS-Headers. And if you are using, let's say, Zen kernel, this is Linux dash Zen dash headers. Now press enter. Agree with why to install all these packages. But as you can see, for me, those two are already installed. I'm not going to do that again. Okay, so now you have Multilib enabled, you have the base development packages plus the Linux headers installed. All you have to do is install the NVIDIA drivers. And yes, you are correct, you have installed the NVIDIA drivers during the installation process if you have paid attention. But you need a couple more things. This is the NVIDIA-UTILS and LIP32-NVIDIA-UTILS. Those two are very important. Installing the 32-bit libraries and some utilities for the NVIDIA drivers that is going to help you huge for playing games on your system. So let's go ahead and do that now. Type down sudo pacman 
dash capital S Nvidia dash DKMS and of course here you have the option to install let's say the open source drivers for the Nvidia I hear they are getting pretty pretty good this is Nvidia dash open but for me still the, the closed source proprietary drivers are still better and I choose to install the NVIDIA dash DKMS package. Also, we need the NVIDIA dash utils and the lib32 dash NVIDIA dash utils. Also, another very important package that we might need this is the NVIDIA dash settings. Okay, this is all we need for now. Just press enter to install them. Agree with Y and once again, I have already installed those right here. So I'm not going to do that. But for you, agree for the installation. Wait for it to finish. And that's it. That's all you need. Now you can start gaming pretty comfortably on your vanilla Arch Linux. So that's all I wanted to show you for today. I hope you find it helpful. If you have any questions, please leave them down in the comment section down below. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.